set up your PicSmart TX3750, you need to plug in your power cord and then make sure you have a clear space near your power outlet where you can plug the bad boy in. Um, I've moved this to the table where it will be staying permanently. I'm, I'm going to be taking out all of this orange tapes around it. Um, just taking out carefully so I don't break anything. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to take those out. I have to open up the printer to take the last bit out, which I did here. As you can see, the inside of the printers, the two um, ink cartridges, sitters. But then it comes with like this, just like an instruction in case you forget how to install your ink cartridges, where the colored one will stay, where the black one will stay. And these are the ink cartridges that came with the printer. You can see written clearly on it, colored and black. This is how it looks like once you take them out. And you see the screen here, do not touch it. Make sure you do not touch it. You just pull out this covering very, very gently and then you install it into the box here where it's meant to stay. You just pull the box down, it's very easy, and then you can pull it back up. Since we're installing the black, you see, you put the black into the section where the black is supposed to be, and you put it facing facing forward, like that part asks you not to touch. You put it facing into the printer, and you put it in, and then you snap it back up. Easy peasy. You put it in, put it in, then you snap it back up snap it back up my nails were making it beats but you get what i mean like snap it up and it's locked bam like that <laughs> now let's do the other one together you see how it is you put it in facing forward into the printer put it in see very easy and then you snap it back up yes 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 you see how easy that was then now you can close your printer doors close the doors babies it's going to bring up an error message if you don't close the doors anyway so remember to close the doors now i'm just going to turn on the printer it's going to take a while to come up turn it on you see that green button there it's gonna blink and when it stops blinking you know your printer is ready and you see this small section here yeah, is that it's gonna keep rotating until it comes like zero and then you know it's ready it's ready for you to print wait <laughs> It does take a while so you have to be patient but as soon as it stops blinking and then it turns zero there and you can see the A4 on the screen then you know your printer is ready. So now we're going to test it out by doing some photocopies. Let's do it. Make sure your papers are seated in properly. Make sure it says A4 on the screen and then we're good to go. We're going to try out the colored printing now. Before this, I already printed out in black. I'm going to be showing you guys in a bit. So you can see it takes a while though. Be patient, guys. Can you see how beautiful the colored one came out? I'm going to be showing you guys the black one now. See how beautiful it is in black and white. And see how beautiful it is colored. Wow. Yeah, I forgot to show you guys. You paste the manual on this glass part, you cover it, and then you press either color or black to print. Now to the front part, you download the Canon Print app on your phone, and then you just follow the instructions. It's very, very easy to navigate. It's very easy. I'm going to show you guys. So just watch. It's very self-explanatory.
it does take a while to get connected but now let's get to the fun part let's print a photo let's go so you choose a photo from your library from your icloud whatever you're comfortable see i chose like a photo of myself and now we're going to be printing it let's see let's see the quality let's see how good it's gonna be let's see i'm so excited to show you guys you can always change the size on your phone and see what size you want but i'm gonna be printing this four by six size on my a4 paper so it's just gonna be like half no like one quarter of the paper now is preparing to print it's gonna come out in with a gloss finish and voila wow wow can you believe this is printed on an a4 paper like literally a4 paper guys there's so much more you can do you can scan um documents you can print documents you can print pictures you can print from your phone from your iCloud files, whatever it is you want to. Your PicSmart TS the 750i is there for you. Anyways, this is so much fun setting up. It was so easy and I was done in less than 30 minutes, I guess. Now I'm just quickly going to show you guys how you can scan and save document directly on your phone like using your printer. I've just scanned the manual again and see how easy it is to just scan and save to my phone. Like it's just so easy to use. Yeah remember placement is important because i'm just showing you guys a sample i just like placed it anyhow but see how quick and easy it is to like save to your files very easy to use very easy to i'm very satisfied with this purchase and i went ahead to print pictures for my vision board which will be my next video be the next video i'll be dropping on my channel these are some of the pictures i'll be creating my vision for 2025 so guys like subscribe tune in happy printing and see you in my next video Mwah.